students welcome to our channel general learnings in this video you are going to learn about time so what are the topics you are going to cover in this video are sequence of the day clock hour and minute hand read the clock at close we will sum some exercise first we will see the sequence of the day in a day there will be a morning afternoon evening noon midnight morning the time when sun rises or you wake up that means the time between 12 o'clock at night and 12 o'clock in the middle of the day will be morning next afternoon the time between noon and the sunset will be afternoon which means from around 12 am until approximately 6 pm will be afternoon next evening the sun is starting to go down that is before night fall so which means evening takes place between 6 pm and 9 pm next noon midday or 12 o'clock during the day will be a moon next midnight 12 o'clock during the night or middle of the night which means when the day changes that is the transition from one day to the next day will be midnight next we will see about clock this is a clock it tells us the time the face of the clock is called dial next we will see hour hand and minute hand how many hands do we see on this clock we see two hands the long hand is called the minute hand the short hand is called the hour hand how many numbers do we see on this clock we see numbers from 1 to 12 on the face of a clock next we will see how to read the clock when minute hand points to number 12 and hour hand points to any number on the face of the clock the time is read as o clock for example in the above clock the minute hand is pointing towards the number 12 and the hour hand is pointing towards the number 3 so how you will read the time the time so the time will be 3 o clock next help zara to be on time Zara wake ups at so now here in this clock the minute hand is pointing towards twelve and the hour hand is pointing towards seven so what will be the time the time will be seven o clock so Zara wake up at seven o clock next Zara needs to catch the bus at so in this clock the minute hand is pointing towards twelve. and the hour hand is pointing towards 8 so what will be the time the time will be 8 o'clock so zora need to catch the bus at 8 o'clock next zora comes back from school at so again in the clock the minute hand is pointing towards 12 and the hour hand is pointing towards 3 so what will be the time the time will be 3 o'clock so zora comes back from the school at 3 o'clock next i given some worksheet you do it at home thanks for watching if you want more videos like this please go and visit my youtube channel at general learnings 91 thank you